Check out this wild 1973 Dodge Charger. Taken off the drag race circuit and turned into a custom show car. Let's meet the owner and review the project. Okay, Ray, how's it going? Good, good. So you brought the car all the way down from Poughkeepsie? Poughkeepsie, New York. Trailing it down, close bed. Uh, close trailer. How many miles would you say that was to get here? Two and a half hour ride, so. Nice. As you can see by all the stuff we've got going on here, we're worth the ride, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. All right, so we're going to do a nice wild custom interior. Imagine a beautiful exterior. This a lot of metallic. Incredible. How yeah. is this gold metallic done in here? Uh, guy from uh, Orange County Choppers, Howie, uh -huh. he works with them and he, he laid it in there. Special process to do. He's really only the few uh, people that can do it. That is wild. How about this, uh, the hood and the scoop and all this? Same thing, 23 karat gold and letters. And is this all fiberglass? All fiberglass. And how does this open? Custom uh, tilt front, almost like a Corvette here where we split the fenders. And it's full. The whole thing's going to come Alright, now what we have to do is we have to make the interior look as wild as the exterior. Absolutely, that's what I'm down. Okay, so let's see. some work. Let's see what we're starting with here. We got, uh, it's all tubbed out. You full got the uh, full race setup. All the way. Okay. Carpeting. We'll, we'll dynamat the whole floor. Uh, the dynamatting will give you a real good sound insulation. Uh, we'll reduce all the road noise, the road vibration, and it has a silver foil on it, and that will reduce the heat that's reflected into the car. So it'll keep it cool, keep it quiet. It'll also make your sound system sound better. On your panels, the side panels of the car over there. Right. You know, right now you just got the bare aluminum, but you do have a continuation: the firewall wrapping right around into the kick panel area, into the door panel, and then into the quarter panel back there. Everything could be wrapped in the the same black leather vinyl combination that we're going to do on the seats. Right. And we'll integrate in a flowing design of the gold metallic.
want to do anything with that dash bit. Absolutely. Every, every, every bit of this, the whole thing could be padded and wrapped. That's what I like to have on that. Uh, the whole top surface also, yes. right? Yep. Okay. Custom stereo yeah, system. Right, that is it. You got the idea going. You got the, that's the start of the idea. This is old school here. This is old. So now you have the options. We can uh, custom CD player okay. there too. We'll, we'll put a really nice, full-featured stereo system. It can either be built right into the dash or it can be built into this portion of the console. Probably right a console, here. right? Yeah, that would be the best spot for it. Yeah. We could also do 10-inch uh, subwoofers in the back wall and mount the amplifiers. And Plus, you have no rear seat, you have it tugged out back into this car. This lends itself to a beautiful display, Absolutely. which we normally have to build into the trunks, but in this case, we build it right in here, so a real glitzy, bling bling type, type setup. We're looking for. Plastic shells. Yep. Yep. So what we want to do is take those seats out and we want to put in a set of padded, upholstered, reclinable race buckets. Comfortable.
let's take a look at the finished project and see the amazing interior transition that has taken place. Check it out, it's ready, man. If you haven't seen it in a while. Oh, this is awesome. Awesome. How are we looking? Oh, this is beautiful. Excellent. All right, Ray, I also want to give you this uh, another award winner by AutoMap because this car tops them all. This looks awesome, man. We appreciate the opportunity to do it. It looks great. Enjoy the show season. And uh, lay that out. That's to you. Thank you. Thank you very much.